Hi, I'm Tom Hathaway. And if you've ever stared at a Medicare plan comparison and felt like you were reading ancient hieroglyphics, this video is for you. Here's the truth. Medicare decisions are complicated. The stakes are high. And the websites are designed by people who apparently hate clarity. But here's the good news. AI tools can turn this nightmare into something manageable. Not easy, mind you, but manageable. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to use free AI tools like Perplexity and Google's Notebook LM to find the right Medicare coverage for your specific situation. Whether you're joining Medicare for the first time and feeling overwhelmed like I was, or your current Medicare Advantage plan just sent you that dreaded discontinuation letter, we're going to walk you through this together, step by step, click by click, with explanations for every decision, by the way. Fair warning, this isn't a five-minute miracle cure video. We're going to spend real time on this because Medicare matters. But by the end, you'll understand not just what to click, but why you're clicking it. You'll see how AI transforms hours of confused research into focused, intelligent comparisons. And you'll have a process you can replicate yourself right now for your own zip code and your own medical needs. So stick around until the end, and we'll give you a template of the prompts that you can copy and paste just to save you all that typing or talking. Before we dive deeper, a quick request. If you find this helpful, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We're building a community of people who are learning to use AI tools practically, not theoretically. When you subscribe and comment, you're telling YouTube to show these videos to other folks who need them. Your aunt in Tampa who's confused about her Medicare options. Your neighbor who just got this discontinuation notice. All right, let's get started. We start with perplexity and my personal AI research assistant, or as I like to call it, the librarian who never needs coffee breaks. I'm typing a very specific question. Where on the official Medicare website can I find insurance options in my area? Now notice the wording. I'm not asking it to explain Medicare. And that's like asking your mechanic to explain heart surgery. I just want the official government tool. Using AI like this is about precision. It's the difference between asking for a scalpel or a chainsaw. Perplexity uses the magic site.medicare.gov command, meaning it only searches official sources. No ads, no sponsored content, and no mysterious websites offering free coverage if you just give them your social security number. And there it is, the plan finder tool, the one you'd normally find after 45 minutes of digital wandering. AI just handed us the map and marked the treasure with an X. It even explains the steps, enter your zip code, filter plans, compare. This is AI as a compass, not a captain. You're still steering, but now you actually know where you're going. Perplexity also tells us the tool compares Medicare Advantage, Plan D, and Medigap plans. That's like knowing which rides are open before you buy the amusement park ticket. 30 seconds of prep now saves 20 minutes of confusion later. Call it digital reconnaissance. AI helps you look smart before you even start. Welcome to Medicare.gov, the official site, the real deal, no middlemen. This is the trustworthy source everyone should use but many people don't even know it exists. They end up on ad-filled broker sites where help often means sales pitch. Now we enter a zip code, 85367, Yuma, Arizona. Medicare Advantage plans are local like barbecue styles or dialects. What works in Florida might not even exist in Arizona. This step tells the system where you live so it can show you relative plans. I hit continue. Next. I select the Medicare Advantage Part C. Think of this as the combo meal, hospital, doctor, and usually drugs, all under one roof. Simple, streamlined, but not one size fits all. AI can help you see the fine print later. For now, you're just setting the right filter. The system asks if I get cost assistance. I select no. Click continue. Each question here is building a custom query. 
The tool asks if I want to include my prescriptions. I say no, but only for demonstration purposes. In real life, skipping this step would be like buying a car without checking if it has an engine. Drug costs can vary wildly. Enter your medications if you actually want meaningful results. Now, I can add my doctor. Most people care more about this than any premium or deductible. If your doctor is not covered, that plan is basically a gym membership you'll never use. So filter for providers first. AI can analyze the rest later. I type in my doctor's name, Adil Baig. If he's not in network, the plan's off the table. Now, unlike original Medicare, Advantage plans limit you to their network. AI will help you compare costs later, but this first step saves you from disappointment and road trips for checkups. 16 plans appear for Yuma, Arizona. Great. Also overwhelming. Filter for includes drug coverage. Simple but crucial. Some plans don't include prescriptions. That's a nasty surprise to discover in January. Filters are your friend. They reduce the chaos and make AI's later analysis cleaner and faster. So adding Dr. Baig to my provider list ensures only plans with him in network appear. I click a plan, Devoted Core Oslo 7, like James Bond, Arizona HMO, zero premium, zero health deductibles. It looks good, but comparing manually would take hours. And this again is where AI swoops in like a caffeinated spreadsheet superhero. Click print, but don't worry, we're saving to PDF, not killing trees. That PDF is our data file, and AI loves data like toddlers love snacks. It'll analyze this later in seconds. I'm going to save this as devotedcore007.pdf. Good naming saves future headaches. AI won't mix up your files if you don't. Clean hygiene equals faster analysis and less swearing later. Back to perplexity. Time for a new trick. Using AI to compare plans automatically. So instead of 30 minutes of clicking, it'll take 30 seconds of good prompting. I ask Perplexity, list all 2026 Medicare Advantage plans in ZIP 85367 with premiums, out-of-pocket limits, and official links. Perplexity digs through Medicare.gov and plan sites, compiles data, and formats it neatly. No clicking, no confusion, just organized facts. Finally, an assistant that doesn't call in sick. Find 16 plans and even groups them by PPO versus HMO. That's bonus intelligence. It organizes results in ways humans find useful. Two tables appear, one for PPOs, one for HMOs, each with premiums, deductibles, and out-of-pocket limits. AI turned a wall of text into something you can actually read without caffeine jitters. It even adds a short summary. 16 plans, 12 PPOs, 4 HMOs, premiums starting at $0. I like that number. AI is not just presenting data, it's summarizing insights. It's like hiring a really neat, nerdy analyst, minus the invoice. Now, we import everything into Google Notebook LM. This is where the magic really happens. AI that understands your documents, not the entire internet. Upload your planned PDFs that you just downloaded, your cost sheets and Medicare handbook, and you've got your own custom research assistant. So I'm going to upload multiple planned PDFs, Devoted, Humana, WellCare, etc. Is this tedious? Well, a bit. But AI can't analyze what you don't feed it. Garbage in, garbage out again. Now, I asked Notebook LM, compare all available 2026 Medicare Advantage plans in Yuma, Arizona. Summarize in a table. So AI reads hundreds of pages faster than you can find your reading glasses. It's like having 20 interns who don't need snacks. Notebook LM spits out a massive table comparing premiums, deductibles, and even perks like dental and vision. Now, of course, you could do this manually, but it would take you until open enrollment 2027. AI recommends Humana Gold Plus HMO for balance between cost and coverage. Zero dollars deductible, lowest out of pocket. A solid choice, but the smart move? Ask follow-ups. Never take the first AI answer as gospel. We compare it against the Humana PPO that gives a $74 monthly rebate. Oh, sounds great, right? 
up the deductible sire. Welcome to healthcare math. You win some, you pay some. AI lays out trade-offs, not miracles. I save the AI's recommendation as a note, because in a week, I'll forget what I decided. Documentation keeps your logic clear, especially when you're explaining your choice to your family, or to your future you, even. Before you go any further, here's an important reality check. Tools like Notebook LM can help you understand your options. But Medicare is far too complex <sighs> to rely on AI alone. Think of this as prepping you with the right questions. The real decision should always be made with a qualified independent insurance agent who can look at your specific situation. Now I ask, which plan works best for someone traveling between Arizona and Minnesota? Advantage plans don't do routine care outside your service area. Ouch. Well, at least it's honest. <laughs> Notebook LM creates a travel coverage table showing HMOs and PPOs side by side. Conclusion? Only emergencies are nationwide. If you want regular care everywhere, go back to original Medicare. Plus Medigap, of course. For travelers, AI suggests PPOs like AARP or Humana Essentials. Flexible, but costlier. And even then, coverage isn't perfect. Again, AI gives you context, not fairy tales. So I ask, for someone with chronic back pain and monthly physical therapy, which plan costs the least? AI crunches the numbers. Finally, math it helps instead of haunts. The AI compares annual PT visit costs. One plan charges $20 per visit, another $60. That's a $960 difference annually. So AI doesn't just save time, it saves money. The Devoted Care 007 HMO wins for therapy users. But AI confirms the plan even covers acupuncture and related treatments. It's not just answering, it's connecting dots. Intelligent follow-up is where AI shines brightest. It checks that all my shortlisted plans actually cover my therapies. No guesswork, no fine print surprises. Having all documents uploaded makes cross-referencing instant. Next question. What happens if I switch to Medigap? AI creates a pro-con table. Advantage bundles everything but is regional. Medigap adds flexibility but loses dental and drug coverage. No fluff, just facts. AI explains Part D penalties, the late enrollment fee that never goes away. This is where people trip up. AI is like a friend reminding you not to press reply all at work. It compares dental benefits. Advantage often includes them. Medigap doesn't. So your free cleaning suddenly costs 150 bucks. Knowing that helps you decide whether nationwide flexibility is worth it. So we wrap up by balancing priorities. Do you want travel flexibility? Or do you prefer bundled benefits and simplicity? AI can lay out the trade-offs, but only you can decide what matters most. That's the partnership. AI delivers clarity. You deliver wisdom. So there you have it. Now we just used free AI tools to do what would normally take you an entire weekend of frustration and several phone calls to confused insurance agents. So let me recap what we learned today because this matters. First, you learned how to use perplexity to cut through the internet noise and find official Medicare resources fast. No ads, no scams, just the actual government tools you need. Second, you saw how to work the Medicare plan finder systematically, entering your zip code, filtering for your doctors, and narrowing down real options. Third, and this is the big one, you learned how to feed those planned documents into Google's Notebook LM and ask intelligent questions that compare costs, coverage, and trade-offs specific to your situation. But here's what you really learned. AI isn't magic. It's a tool. A powerful tool, sure, but only as good as the questions you ask and the data you feed it. You still need to know what matters to you your doctors, your medication, your travel habits, your budget. AI can't decide those things. What it can do is take your priorities 
and crunched through hundreds of pages of insurance fine print faster than any human could, then present you with clear comparisons so you can make informed decisions. The same process works whether you're in Yuma, Arizona or Portland, Maine, whether you're 65 and joining Medicare for the first time, or 78 and your insurance policy just dropped your plan. The tools are free. The method is replicable. The only cost is your time and attention. Now, one more favor before you go. If this video helped you understand either Medicare or AI better, please like it and share with someone who needs it. Your sister who's turning 65 next month. Your friend whose plan just got discontinued. Your parents are drowning in Medicare mailings. The algorithm doesn't care about good intentions. It cares about engagement. When you like and share, you can help these tutorials reach people who actually need them. And if you haven't subscribed yet, do that now. We put out new AI tutorials regularly, all focused on practical problems that real people over 50 actually face. Not theoretical nonsense, not tech bro hype, just useful tools explained clearly. Finally, drop a comment below. Tell me, did this make sense? What Medicare questions are you still confused about? What what other real-world problems should we tackle with AI next? I read every single comment, and your questions help us make better videos. Sometimes they even become the next tutorial. So thanks for sticking with me through this. I know it wasn't short, but Medicare isn't simple. And I'd rather respect your intelligence than pretend there are easy answers. You've got the tools. Now use them. And if you get stuck, well, that's what the comment section's for. See you in the next video.